hey guys welcome back to another video so today i'm doing a hard gel infill over my client's natural nails i've already removed her previous design and i've repaired her middle nail because she broke that one so we've popped a tip on there i've done all my cuticle work and i've ran over the nails with urban nails magic prep and now i've just gone in with their primer which is their super bond and now I'm going to be applying Urban Nails Base Gel to all of these nails and then I will pop that into the lamp to cure for 60 seconds. So I'm now going in with Urban Nails fiber gel in clear and I'm just going to apply a thin layer to the ring finger and the index finger because we're going to be popping some glitter on there and then I'll pop that into the lamp to cure for 60 seconds. So on that ring finger and that index finger I'm going to be using Nail Sugar's Poppin' Peony and this is a gorgeous multi-mix glitter so you've got big chunks of oranges, peaches and pinks running through it as well as some iridescent fine glitter and some cute little stars in there so I'm just using a little bit of Urban Nails clear gel to pick up the glitter with and then I'm spreading that over the entire nails and you'll be able to see that I'm making sure that I've got all my glitter in place and all nice and flat before I pop it into the lamp to cure. With hard gel, it is super, super important to make sure that it's super flat before you pop that into the lamp. So once I've done that, I'm gonna pop that into the lamp to cure for 60 seconds. So now I'm going to use Urban Nails Clear over all of these nails and capping that glitter in as well. I'm going to be making sure that I've got my apex in and my structure and making sure that I've capped all of the glitter and that there's none showing. And once I've done this on all of the nails, I'm going to pop this into the lamp to cure for 60 seconds. So I'm now going to use Urban Nails Cleanser just to remove that sticky inhibition layer and then I'm going to go in with my 180 grit file and start refining these nails, making sure that there's no lumps and bumps and that I've got my apex nice and flowing back into that cuticle. And then once I've done that, I'm going to take my e-file bit and I'm going to be using the fine just to whiz around that cuticle area and then sidewalls. So once I've done this, I'm going to go in with my e-file and you'll see that on her index finger, a natural nail grows naturally downwards. So I've corrected that today so it comes out nice and straight, but that's going to create quite a bulk on the free edge. So when I've got my fine e-file bit and I get to that nail e-file just underneath the enhancement just to thin that out but without taking away from the structure so we can then correct it and it looks lovely like all the other nails so it's not going to be sloping down you don't want to look like you've got a claw on there 
So I'm just going to take that e-file now and I'm just going to whiz it round underneath that free edge to thin that out. And then we're ready for the design. So I'm now going to use Semilax Ruby Charm on the little nail and the thumb. And then I'm going to be using Semilax Strong White on that middle nail. And once I've applied this colour and I'm happy with it, I'm going to pop it into the lamp to cure for 30 seconds. So I'm now going to repeat the process with the second coat and then I'll pop that into the lamp again to cure for 30 seconds. So on this middle nail I'm going to be doing a stencil style rose so I'm going to take some of that ruby charm that we used on the little nail and thumb and I'm going to be taking a detail brush and I'm going to start in the centre of this nail and I'm going to start forming my petals with that product and then I'm going to work my way outwards. Once I'm happy with how it's looking I'll pop it into the lamp to cure for 30 seconds. I'm now going to use a no wipe top coat and I'm going to apply this to all of the nails and just look at how pretty that pink is and next to this glitter oh just mind blown it's just so pretty absolutely in love with these once I've done this I'm going to pop that into lamp to cure for 60 seconds I'm going to pop some crystals around the cuticle area on the little finger and thumb. So I'm using Urban Nails Gem Gel and as always Crystal Parade Swarovski Crystals. Once I'm happy with the placement I will pop that into the lamp to cure for 60 seconds. So this is the finished result guys, as always I'm popping a bit of cuticle oil on, I hope you enjoyed this video, my client absolutely loved these and so did I, and they're so pretty and sparkly, but please like and subscribe.